Wine Enthusiast TV. I'm Michael Schachner, contributing editor for South America. We are in Tupungato, in the Finca Oluvia, one of Dona Paola's three estates in the Uco Valley. I'm with Eddie Del Popolo, technical director for Dona Paola. Eddie, this seems like a really unique spot. Well, thank you, Michael. Yes, you can see, we are in a, one of our best terroirs here in the Uco Valley. Aluvia Vineyards represents for us a great place because it's a perfect combination between climate and soils. And it's a driving factor to create very good quality wines. Eddie, tell us about the vines and how they're planted and also about the soil composition. Well, as you can see, we have here bush vines and they were planted in this kind of old and very unique system because the soil composition, right? The soil composition is, is very poor. It's uh, no mineral, no mineral content here, full of rocks, a lot of calcium carbonate in the, in the subsoil that makes uh, a, a very unique place to make uh, very mineral kind of wines. Are the wines different from here? Absolutely. The wines we have been making the last vintages from these bush vines are very unique in terms of aromas. They, are, they have pure type of fruit. They have a kind of violet notes. They have a, uh, an incredible personality and uniqueness compared to the other wines we make in the winery. We started the day in Tupungato at Finca Aluvia. Now we are at Siete Cocinas, the most hip and inventive restaurant in Mendoza. It's a perfect place to taste the fruits of the vineyard we are at today. Eddie, what do we have here? I have brought a this wine is uh, a wine that comes from Finca Aluvia. It's a 2009 vintage, and it's a wine we're gonna release at the end of the year. Wow, what a focused wine. It's just so perfectly pointed in the right direction. I'm impressed. Well, I, I, I like this wine because it reflects very well the 2009 vintage that was great, one of the best, full of blackberries and mulberries and, and dark, dark type of fruit. I also like it because it's not oaky. There's an oak framework to it, but it's not too much front and center. The oak is always supporting the fruit, but the fruit, the fruit is always in the front. There's a fantastic layering and quality of flavor. I really think this is one of the best wines you guys have ever made. I'm very happy with that. Michael. Sweet breads, sweet and hot. Sweet and hot and spicy. Excellent. We have Pablo Del Rio, chef of Siete Cocinas. And here we go. For you. Enjoy. Thanks.